Hey guys, how's it going? It's Jewel Tolentino here. All right, so in this video, I'm going to be doing Merch My Amazon update number 52. All right, guys, so I'm here filming outside right now. So I apologize if you hear any honking or car noises or weird animals or birds. So in this video, I'm going to be talking about the Merch Checker software. Now, I wanted to create a video about this software because I recently just bought and used this software and I want to share it with you guys because I wish I had found this software before I went through literally days and days and hours and hours of checking my listings. So if you guys remember, Amazon released that statement that you can't say certain things about the shirts, you can't... The thing that really got us was we said, for a looser size, order a size up. And we put that on almost all of our descriptions, like on the bullet points. And so when they released that announcement, they gave you like 30 days, but then they gave you like another 30 days. I went through literally every single listing one by one. I tried to make it more systematic with like opening 10 at once, like opening 10 windows at once and then doing one and then, you know, having that window already open. So I tried to create systems that would make it faster for myself. And then maybe like two, three days ago, I saw that Neil from Merch Informer had posted about Merch Checker. So I checked it out, read it, bought it, tried it out, and I seriously wish I had found this software before I spent, I don't know, a good week and hours and hours going through all of our listings. If you don't know what Merch Checker is, it's basically a software that was created to check all of your listings for words and phrases that you're not supposed to have in your, you know, listings. So this is Merch Checker right here, and I will have the link to check it out down in the description below. But basically, this is sort of like the sales page, and you know, I was going to purchase initially the $6.99 per month, that's US, but then I saw that they had another option here for $19.99 and that was for 6 months and it's a 52% savings. And I just went ahead and got that because to me it was like, okay, it's 20 bucks, I'll have it for half a year. And because I had already gone through all that pain, to me paying $20 to have some software check everything was worth it to me. So when you purchase through here, you are going to get like a code that you need to enter in after you download the Chrome extension. So once you purchase from there, you need to head over to the Chrome Google store. I will also have this link down in the description and you need to install this Chrome extension because that's how it works. It's a Chrome extension and then you need to put what you bought, the code and the key into this Chrome extension for it to work. Now I will say that you need to note, I, I saw this here after trying to figure out how to use it, the extension only becomes active when you're in the Manage tab of your Merch by Amazon account. So it may seem like it's not working initially until you get to the Manage tab. That's what I thought. So once you install the Chrome app, uh, it's going to pop up right here and it's going to be like a t-shirt with like a magnifying glass and it's going to be like gray. It's going to be grayed out. That means it's not active yet. And if you want to read up more on it, you can, but basically this is going to save you the headache of going through all of your listings. Once you have those two things installed, you have your code activation key and then you have the Chrome extension, then you can head over to your Merch by Amazon account. So from here, when you sign in, you need to be in the Manage tab, and then you're going to notice that the Chrome extension Merch Checker went from gray to black, so now it's like alive. When you click on it, it's going to ask you to enter in your license key. That's the thing that you got from the very first link when you purchased. There, there's a an activation key. It's like a bunch of letters and numbers, or maybe just letters. So I've got my license key. I'm going to enter it in here, click license the app, and now you're ready to use it. So 
you can add in new words that you want it to check or you can just leave it as is and let it check the, the current words that have already been previously inputted. So here are the words that are already inputted into the Chrome extension that they're going to check out. So you can see here like, you know, printed to be fitted, order a size up, that's what we had. So you can add your own here or you can click the start checking and then it's just going to automatically check the words that I just showed you. So before you hit start checking, you want to make sure that you go to all of your live listings. Then from there, you want to hit up and go to from 15 results to 100 results so that it's going to check 100 results at one time. So if you have it show only 15 at a time, it's going to check 15 and then the process is just going to take you much longer. So make sure that you set it to 100 so that you can get the maximum amount of checking. All right, so now that I have this set, I am now going to head over to the Chrome extension, Merch Checker, click Start Checking. And then at the bottom right, it's going to say check current page. We're going to click on that. It's going to say please wait. And then you'll start to see little notes that Merch Checker is going to let you know about. So for instance, when it's green and it says product clear, obviously that product is clear and it's good to go and there's nothing wrong with it. Now, you see this one right here, I have a word in there that says fit and I have one word that has the word fit in it. So at that point, I can go in, click actions, click edit, and then go check out what's happening with that listing. Now you see, without this software, I wouldn't have known that. I would have had to go through each one and, you know, check them out one by one. And, you know, potentially I probably could have missed a few because even though I did all of them manually, I used the Merch Checker software as sort of like, you know, a double check and even triple check. And I saw that I missed a bunch of them. I definitely missed a handful of them because when you're opening so many tabs, you have a thousand designs, things are going to get confusing and, and you're going to accidentally close some windows. And if you checked one again or you didn't check it and it's just, it becomes a, a really big mess. And I will say during that time, of checking each listing, I was not happy. So as you can see, I'm scrolling down more. Everything else is clear. You get down to the bottom and everything is cleared. So then what do you do next? You go on to the next page of 100 and you do the exact same thing again. So here I am on page two and then you can click the check current page button. You don't need to go to the top and check click the icon again, you can actually just click from the bottom right once you initially start it up. So as you can see here on the second page, this section right here, all the products are clear. And if there is something, a word that it's found, a phrase, then it's going to show you right below that listing title and it's going to show it to you in a different color. All right, so that is it. That is pretty much how you use the Merch Checker software. Like I said, I seriously wish I found this before all that stuff happened and I had to basically, you know, spend hours and hours wasting my time. It actually did save me time because I was going to do a double check and go through each listing manually just to double check before the date that everything was going to be okay. But since finding this software, it has made it a lot easier and it has saved me a lot of time. So I highly recommend this software. It's $6.99 a month or $19.99 for the first six months. And in my opinion, it's worth the price. If you wanna check it out, head down to the description below. I will have the links for you guys. All right guys, well thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Back, back, back from the dead.